The bivouac is a working area located between the finish time controls and the start of a stage. It serves as a place where competitors camp for the night and the primary support base for the race. It is a controlled and secured closed surface over a huge area for private use as part of the Dakar Rally, access to which is exclusively and uniquely reserved for all persons accredited by the organizer. There are between 2,500 and 3,000 people in the bivouac, including competitors, mechanics, team staff, rally officials, medical staff and media representatives. In essence, the Dakar Rally bivouac is like a small travelling city following the race, providing all the necessary logistical support for the smooth functioning of the race. This includes such things as water, catering, waste services, electricity, internet, satellites, TV production and all other necessary medical and technical facilities. Bivouacs are usually set up in or near an airport. Indeed, organizer executives, members of the press and other individuals who are not actually competing in the rally move from bivouac to bivouac by helicopter or plane. It is common to say during the event that the Dakar doesn't wait. So there will be often two to three bivouacs built in different places at the same time in order to keep up with the demands of the race and enable the smooth transition between race locations. One special type of bivouac is also set up during the marathon stage of the race, a two-day stage where no outside service such as team mechanics is authorised. The only authorised service is between competitors still racing and so the bivouac is set up to reflect these restrictions. Through it all, the bivouac is an integral and crucial part of the Dakar experience without which the event could not take place.